everyone, so it's day eight of what I learned today, and today I learned to be precise with your language. Um, this is a lesson that I first heard of while reading Dr. Jordan Peterson's book, 12 Rules for Life, An Antidote to Chaos. Uh, one of the chapters is talking about precise language. Uh, basically, to really roughly summarize the whole chapter, is our world is full of crazy things. There's so much we cannot learn and be aware of. The world is just crazy. It's way out of our grasp of uh, understanding um, in our lifetime. And the lesson is just be precise with what you say because if you're not precise, there's no possible way for you to understand what you're describing. So um, I learned this today at work. Um, with one of my coworkers, Michael. Um, shout out to Michael. He has a vlog channel, so I was talking about, um, you know, getting critiques on my series because I, I desperately need people to critique what I've been doing to know what I can improve on. And, you know, I was telling him that I could help him out because he also has a YouTube channel. I could critique his work and we can both improve um, through helping each other out. So I was telling him, you know, I could critique him, um, I could help him out, and I told him that my girlfriend's out of town and she's not able to critique, but she usually um, helps me out. But he kept diverting the conversation and deflecting what I was saying, and I, and I wasn't sure why, because I was just like trying to be nice. I was like, hey, we could critique our, each other's YouTube channel and our content, um, and I thought I was being nice, and I wasn't sure why he was deflecting so much, and then I found out later that he thought I was proposing something promiscuous by saying hey my girlfriend's out of town I could help you out and you know we had recently been talking about our YouTube channel so I thought maybe um, connect the two because it was like a breaking conversation I do this thing where I jump right back into conversations like a half an hour um, later especially at work because we get interrupted by guests and stuff so I, I do that a lot and I thought maybe he would connect the two but it ended up that he was interpreting a completely different message and uh, it was just this I mean it was really funny it was really funny to point out the absurdity of the situation and that I was what I meant to be saying was completely different than what he was understanding so it was a funny situation we both had a laugh about it and I just learned to be more precise with my language talk directly say what you mean and be very particular with your word choice something that made me sad today is that I'm still kind of disappointed with yesterday's video I really wanted to do that long video reflecting on this previous week um, so I'm still a little bit disappointed in that but something that made me happy is that my girlfriend is gonna come visit. Um, it's a surprise what she, her plans for her day off kind of fell through, so she's just gonna go visit me. So that's what I learned today. What did you learn today? As always, leave it in the comments down below, and if you like this content, make sure you subscribe. Maybe consider hitting that bell icon. Um, I do upload every day, but Leave a comment below, let us know what you learned, and we'll have a conversation. But otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow. I don't know, you got like any dirty jokes? It's like, <laughs> is that why you're like trying to gauge the audience here?